I am the Mamas. Jesus is my king. You are my family. In an effort to get more content to you on a more frequent basis and to talk about things in a more topical manner, I'm creating this new series which I'm calling Prayer Position. And what we'll do is we'll discuss some current event, kind of bite-sized and uh, coincide with my Facebook page commentary. And, um, and then also end the segment with a prayer. Uh, without further ado, let's get into today's, today's topic. This was really an incredible thing that happened the other day. Uh, Trump uh, being the first sitting president to visit, uh, to set foot in North Korea. And, you know, as usual, media, mainstream media is trying to do, um, you know, uh, negative views on it and say, oh, well, you know, this is uh, for that reason and this is weakness. What I thought was really pertinent about this meeting was uh, the, the, just the gravity of um, the times we're living in uh, and what we're seeing as, as a change in the type of um, diplomacy and just actions that are happening in the world. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just play the video here and it's going to run in the background, but uh, you'll see Trump stepping up to a uh, line in the uh, pavement and that is actually that's actually the uh, line between the soil of South Korea and North Korea. And uh, what happened here is, you know, Kim walks up and says, good to see you, and uh, I never expected to see you in this place. And then, uh, and then he invites uh, Trump to step across, and Trump steps across. You know, the, the thing that I think is really important to understand when people are trying to diminish it and say, oh, well, you know, uh, you're giving in to the dictator, you're, you know, you're, you're giving him respect that he shouldn't have. I mean, I think it's clear that Trump understands the type of respect that's needed to even have the beginning of a conversation with a dictator like this. Uh, we have to look at, really, the gravity of what is going on in North Korea. This is uh, Open border, open Doors USA, and this is saying, you know, they're one of the, North Korea is, I think it's saying it's the number one, um, uh, number one worst place to be if you're a Christian. Uh, and, you know, how Christians are suffering. Um, if Christians are discovered, uh, not only are they deported to labor camps as pl political criminals or even killed on the spot, their families will share their fate as well. Um, so we have to, I think, really look at what is the end game here? What is, what is the thing that we're really uh, trying to do in negotiations with North Korea? Is it only to stop them from getting nuclear weapons or is it to bring them into the fold of the world, uh, of, of the world at large, and to actually um, cause the influence of Western culture to have a chance of penetrating that environment. And so what I want to do now, why don't we just go to prayer. And I'm going to start all of these prayer positions with the Lord's Prayer. I think it's important that as Christians that we clear our path with God and we clear our sins um, before asking Him for more. So, our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. Lead us not into temptation, but rather protect us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Father, we come to you today and we know that there are many persecuted in the land of North Korea. We pray that this meeting between Trump and Kim change 
what is expected, what is anticipated of those who may be brutal, of those who may have looked at the West as something just to disregard. We pray, Lord, that your light comes into North Korea. We pray not just for our protection, not just for our country, not just for our safety, but we pray for those who don't have any of it. And we pray that they might see it, that they might see the light of your kingdom. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thanks for watching. Please like this video and subscribe to this channel. Catch me on these alternate media sources.